Sorry guys. So for some reason my batteries keep coming going running dry. Alright, so in this temp position you have new beginnings, like I was saying before. So you have new beginnings here, 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 here. You have a lot of new beginnings. These are very passionate beginnings. These are things that you're wanting. These are things that you've been attracted to. It looks like this is what you'll be doing in the month of uh, July and August. So the so the last two weeks of July and into August. This is all about being passionate. This is all about things coming to you. This is all about that energy opening up for you. What are you going to do with it? You're going to get the opportunity, but you have to take the action. That's the thing with the wands, is that you have to take the action to be able to have this beginning. You have to take the action when the opportunity comes in, right? But that's kind of up to you, all right? So let's talk about this eclipse. So in the lunar eclipse, let's ask... What is the thing, or the situation, or the person that we really need to work with, work through, with this lunar eclipse, letting go, understanding, getting rid of old karma, right, with this lunar eclipse. So let's see. So you have the two of coins. So it looks like you'll be balancing something. It looks like you'll be um, keeping some things, but getting ready for the new. I see keeping some of the old, but getting ready for the new. And so in this lunar eclipse, this is about you recognizing what it is that you want to let go of. It's not a bad thing if you don't let go of something old. If you want it, you want to keep it, and you need it, for your life path, for what you're trying to understand, then absolutely, if you're not ready to let it go, you don't. But this is about you balancing the two, balancing the old and the new. And this is what this lunar eclipse is about. This is about balancing your life, balancing your money, balancing your budget, balancing your relationships. That's what the two of coins is. Okay, so that's what they're asking you to do. You don't have to like do the extreme and, and let go of everything. Let go of what it is that no longer serves you at this point, right? So right now, what no longer serves you? That's what they're asking you. And then look to the future too. Don't stay just in the past, but look to the future. Be in your now as well. So for the total solar eclipse that's coming in August. Oh, you have the justice. <laughs> so it looks like some of you ending that old karma like some of you get some justice, some of you get that balance, some of you, if it's been really hard for you last two years, five years, one year, um, three years, you know, um, this is time where it's, it's coming forth for you. It's like really happening for you. It's time for you to be in this new phase, right? For others of you, if this is about, um, you know, something legal, um, something in the court system, um, then it is going to be balanced. You are going to get your day. You are going to get this thing. If somebody's taking advantage of you, you are going to get that. It looks like it's balancing in your favor if that's been taken from you. But I feel like this is like it's time for that old um, karma to be let go of and it's time for that new abundance to come in. And that's what's going to be going on in the month of July and August. All right, my beautiful ones, I love you, love you, love you. Thank you so very much. For those of you that aren't cancer or all the other signs, I'm going to get to you. It is going to take a minute, but just bear with me. I love you, love you, love you. Please be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Bye.